Hey everyone, Kevin Wagstaff here. I'm going to walk you through the wind mitigation form on Spectora. So first of all, you want to make sure you have this set up in your account under your services and fees. So if you're still learning our system, um, you create services, you create add-ons within that descriptions, which template you want to populate modifiers, the whole works. That's for another video. For this purposes, you'll see I have the wind mitigation service set up here. It can be added on to a residential service. I just created it as a separate service here. So I added that and I said, hey, populate Spectora's wind mit form, the approved wind mit form when someone books that service. So you can see on the dashboard, I've already booked this inspection. We're going to click into it and show you the Florida wind mit inspection form here. And what that does is that populates on my mobile app. So you can see off to the right here, now I'm in Spectora's mobile app to do the actual inspection in the app. And part of the benefit of Spectora is you can do the WinMit while using the Spectora app or on desktop. You don't have to use a PDF filler um, to check boxes or try to add photos to the PDF. You can use our app and it populates the WinMit form that you have to submit. So you'll see, I'm going to click into the app here. I'm going to go through, just show you what it looks like to click a couple of buttons in here. So I'm just going in. That's all checked off and great. We're just going to click into a few areas. We got some answers already in there. We're going to click in here. Okay, great. And you're just flying through this thing, right? So that is doing it within the Spectora app, which is kind of famous in the industry. Everyone knows and loves a lot of in Florida and companies have wished they moved over earlier because of the convenience of this. So I know it's a departure from some of you that are used to PDF fillers, but there is speed associated with our app and there is a value to getting used to doing it in here because that's where you're doing your other residential inspections. So I'll speed this up um, and just click through and show you kind of what a finalized report looks like. So I get to the end. I hit save, that's gonna send it up to the cloud, basically show up now in my desktop view. So if I were to go in and edit this inspection at home, clean it up, make sure all the information's correct, I'm gonna see everything I did on the mobile app. Can I add some more info? And that's the beauty, whatever your workflow is, whether it's do a majority of it on site, do some of it on site, clean it back up at the office, you can do that. Um, so you see all the information populated in there. Now I'm just going to click over and show you a completed form, um, just what it looks like. So you put the information in the app, you look at it on desktop inspectora and you hit publish or preview. And this is what you're going to see. You're going to see the PDF. You're going to see everything checked off the way you did it. And then you're going to see some accompanying photos at the end, which a lot of inspectors like to include. And boom, you're done. So that's the beauty of it. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed that. If it's if, if you think it'll be useful, definitely hit us up and um, we'd love to do a demo and show you more about it and show you kind of why a lot of Florida inspectors use Spectora to do four point wind mitt along with residential. Um, I'm just going to preview this form here to show you guys a final view. There it is. So form populates. And you're good to go. So hit us up with questions, guys. We look forward to uh, to helping you out with all this. Thanks.